days okay good morning good afternoon good evening anyway guys so this is going to be the second episode of my construction project my apartment complex so this episode is going to show you guys what the plans are looking like on the computer you know because i think that's where i have to start with you guys so that you can have an idea what we're doing and but another thing that i want to tell you is that we already started construction. I know, I know. I feel like I've been doing such a bad job, guys. I've been all over the place, so busy. Vlogging, the process has been my focus, but it hasn't uh, It hasn't worked according to plans. Because whenever the guys are working on the construction side, I'm probably at school or I'm at my store or I'm dealing with other clients or I'm traveling. Like, I've just been all over the place, okay? So that's why this video... It's kind of late, you know, it's kind of late because I haven't, I really didn't show you guys the part where they were working on the foundation and everything else. Like, so today I'm going to sit down. I'm actually heading to the construction site. I have a little bit of footage that I'm going to show you here and there when I'm explaining certain things to you so that you guys can see where we at. But unfortunately, I don't have the beginning because when they were working, I was busy doing something else. But anyway, so my brother just came, um, parked the car. So now we're going to be going my car and as usual he's gonna be driving my car so we're gonna sit down in my little wood wood house and i have a new desk that i actually manufactured just because i knew that when i go there i would need to sit somewhere and then i brought some chairs so we're gonna sit down and kind of explain to you guys what we're doing and how the project is gonna go so that's what today's video is gonna look like and i'm gonna show you little clips here and there um what the guys have done so far but anyway let's get started with today's video I'm gonna go ahead and explain to you um, what's currently going on. It's the fact that my brother, this guy, decided not to charge his computer, okay? So we can even access the software where all the plants are. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys um, the whole thing. So guys, I just wanted to mention that the land that I'm currently building on is pretty big. So my end goal is to have three to four different apartment complex. Uh, but for the purpose of this video, we're only going to be focusing on one apartment building because you guys know you have to start somewhere. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what the floor plan looks like. So this is the Rue de Chaussée. This is basically just a ground floor, Rue de Chaussée that's the initials for it um so if you're in america this is going to be the first floor plan okay so this is how it's going to go so it's going to be an apartment complex that has six apartment um there's going to be two downstairs two on the second floor and two on the third floor okay so um just one right here is one apartment the other one is another apartment the stairs are going to be in the middle so i'm going to give you the example and explain to you guys how things are kind of like you know um, put together so as you come in you're gonna have an entire um, space here where people can park their cars you're gonna have a garden it's i'm gonna make it pretty so we're gonna talk about that later so when you come in um this is the living space area living room area 
So as you come in, you you have the kitchen right here on your left, and then you have a little hallway that leads to the bedroom. So you have the main bedroom here, and you have the second bedroom, and both of them share one bathroom. Now, if you have guests, right, and then you host them in the living room, guess what? If they want to go to the restroom, they just go up here. This is the door for the restroom. Restroom is basically just... um one i mean one toilet one sink so that's all they need that's why it's, it's tiny it's small so same thing on the second apartment second apartment you come in and then you have the living room area you have your kitchen you have the little hallway you have your master bedroom second bedroom and as well you also have um, a bathroom so now let me explain to you so originally this floor plan was bigger but the reason why i couldn't make it bigger for now and because it was going to cost a lot let me explain it to you <laughs> so i don't know if you guys can see what the land looks like so this right here where i built the wood house is actually the upper area of the land okay this is the area where the land is flat everything else is going downhill i mean you guys can even see those houses down there so it goes downhill and then if you're on this side things goes downhill um i just closed i think at my other video i showed you guys how i did this wall because i needed to separate my land and the neighbor's land so i built this thing here so but if you look in so my land goes all the way there okay all the way there that's all of this that's my land and i have my little farm here that i showed you last time where i get plantains um cassava yucca all of these things so the land this is this part here which is the upper part is the only part that's flat it's not going to require much work in order to build on it so if i had built down there it was going to require me a lot of money to build the same thing there okay it goes downhill so that's the reason why um you guys can see that i really didn't i just used the space i mean first of all it costs money to build in this era second of all my money is you know i'm on a budget so i built um the first floor the ground floor this way but the difference that i made is that on the next floor i made it bigger and i'm gonna explain to you how i managed to make it bigger so you guys can even see picture i mean guys it's dirty i know i'm in construction zone <laughs> so this is the next floor this is going to be the second floor um premier etage so there's an arch here okay i'm going to show it to you i have a video a clip where i show you what it looks like on the computer the building looks like but for example this first floor i mean not the first floor this second floor is going to have balconies which is totally different than here and it's gonna have um i mean let me just walk you through the whole thing okay so when you go up the stairs so this is how you access the next floor you go up the stairs you go up the stairs and then you land right here okay so once you land here this is the first apartment and then oh my god trucks and then you walk this way to access the second apartment that's probably Isakam. this is trash truck or whatever anyway so you go this way to go to the next apartment you go that way to go to the other apartment so as you go in oh my god guys i'm sorry as you go in this is real life okay so as you go in you have this entire i mean the space here is even wider so you can have some place here where you hang your guest clothes you know coats shoes something you can have something here you know so you go in there and then you have the living room area you have the restroom the guest restroom right here okay it's going to be here and then you have the kitchen here you have a little hallway that leads to the uh, master bedroom the second bedroom and then you have the bathroom so now let me compare to the other one okay so the guest i mean the main the master bathroom on the first floor on the ground level is 11.7 square meter but then when you go to the next floor guess what this one is bigger that's what i was telling you guys about it's bigger here okay this space here is bigger the reason is we also created balconies so when you go in you go to the kitchen the kitchen has a door that leads to the balcony okay so that when you're cooking the food because our food here in cameroon smell like 
you know we have strong spices and everything so the master bedroom also has a balcony and i'm going to show you where i got this design from i saw a building not too far from here that had balconies on the side and it was so like it's just tiny balconies okay for the master bedroom and i just thought it was so pretty so this is how the bathroom are going to be looking like this is the concept that i have when i do it you guys will it will make sense i'm not going to have the bathtub i think i will do like a um, shower i do shower so there will be a separation here this way okay separation all the way here and then the this space here is open or you can put a curtain and then you have the toilet and then you have the sink so yeah and then you guys can even see this bedroom is big okay 13.49 square meter compared to nine and nine okay on the ground floor these ones here are bigger and so if you are in the living room each living room have the balconies as well so your guest or you or yourself you can have a nice view here you can put some chairs here so that's basically what it looks like and the guest bathrooms are here okay that's the stairs i hope that really makes sense basically that's that oh uh, so this floor plan is going to be the same thing on the third floor so we're going to have the same thing basically same concept where everything is positioned so the second and third floor are going to have the same floor plan but the first floor which is the ground floor will be like this because of how the land is and i could have done it bigger guys but the bigger you go the more money you spend and so forth and this is my first apartment complex and i wasn't eventually going to build on here but you know what i made the decision and i'm going to build it here <laughs> So guys beside the building there's going to be other different amenities so let's talk about the rental office definitely i would need a rental office um i'm gonna need a gym just because i like people to exercise and i'm gonna need a laundry room i want it to be a little bit big um it's gonna be outside of the apartment complex but i do want it to look a little bit traditional just because you guys know with electricity and everything i can't afford you know um laundry machine and i also want to have a playground for children so everything coming together is going to take some time for now i'm just focusing on that apartment complex because that's my priority as of now Woo, guys i don't want to fall i wasn't coming there's no construction going on here today i'm just showing you guys because i had an appointment here with my brother i'm in a meeting so that we can talk about what's the next step um so okay i don't want to go far so basically this is the neighbor this is another neighbor so you guys can see the land goes this way okay it goes this way and that's another neighbor there so okay um another thing that i also wanted to mention is that i hired the team so the construction that you guys saw i hired the team that's in charge of it my brother is not in charge of it as as of now he's not but he's helping me he's the one who is helping me design the whole thing because you guys know he's a civil engineer so i i designed the whole thing with him okay so that's why i was like please if you have time can you come because my brother is um he's involved in other constru bigger construction projects so he doesn't have much time to kind of assist me on this project for now but at some point he's going to come back so the contract that i have with the team with the contractor that i hired is just for the ground level okay and this is my first time working with him haven't never never worked with him okay my dad is the one who introduced me to him so never work with the guy but um it's just been a bit you know we're gonna go into it at some point so never worked with him before but so the contract that i had with him wasn't to build the whole thing 
it was just to build the first floor the ground level okay so that's the contract that i have with him and i think on the second video my brother and i think on the second i mean not the second the third episode okay i'm going to talk to you guys about pricing how much is costing me um from the foundation to like you know just the ground floor how much is it going to cost me um so that you guys can have an idea because it's not cheap it is not cheap <laughs> it's not cheap guys i didn't even notice i have something here oh gosh anyway i remember at some point i showed my floor plan to my sister and then she was to one of my sisters and then she was like um it's a bit small and then i said yeah but it's costing me abcg and my sister was like what that much <laughs> i'm like yes girl it's money okay so you can do it bigger if you have a construction project in mind apartment complex anything you can do it bigger but i feel like this era that we're going through things are just getting more and more pricey so it's guys that's that's what i could do okay that's what i'm gonna do at least it's gonna look like something and i'm excited because this is my first apartment complex project and yeah i'm just excited why wouldn't you be excited regardless of the size and i feel like this is actually a good size you know i'm all about i need space i want it big and then my dad is the one who kind of put things into perspective my dad was like no this is not your house <laughs> like this is not your house because i was like dad but don't you think you know i can go bigger but it's gonna cost me more money on the foundation and then my dad was like okay you want a budget you may not you don't have a lot of lot lots of money why do you want to do you know like why do you want to spend this much on the ground level you know just on the foundation when you could just build something and then the land is big guys look at all of that the land is big so i can have a second i can have a second building here i can have a third building here and i can have a fourth building here the same building i can have it at least five times on this land so why am i stressing myself it's going to be like a like a mini you know mini city where you see like one two three i still don't know how i'm going to position all of that i can't even tell you guys all i know is that this is the only section of the land that i'm going to be building on for now and then at some point i'll make a decision what i want to do with the rest but i'm actually sharing the land <laughs> i'm not here alone i'm sharing the land with uh, my sister one of my sister yeah we're sharing the land and i just don't know where she's gonna go yet <laughs> guys anyway thank you guys for watching i hope this video was insightful i feel like it was a bit boring but guys whew, i hope it was insightful okay next video is going to be talking about cash money don't pay attention to the dirt okay these guys left for the weekend and left all the dirt tomorrow when they come back they're going to be working on that okay cleaning the area so um i'm going to talk to you next time and when i talk to you we're going to be talking about money okay we're going to be talking about how much it's costing me and yeah and whatever people tell you is going to cost it's never it's never that it's never this is something that i learned the hard way when i was when i started building the school okay this is something that i learned the hard way people would tell you oh madam in order to do abcg it will cost you and then guess what you spend the money you prepare the budget and then you go over 1.2 million or 2.4 million or 5 million like no so whatever they tell you in cameroon whatever they tell you the budget is it's never the budget you have to make sure that you have more money in your pocket okay so we're going to talk about that on the next video and then go from there so thank you guys for watching don't forget to like subscribe and i'll catch you